Hey everybody, my name is Nate Garochi, and uh, I'm going to be your or your student's chemistry teacher for this year. <laughs> uh, I wanted, to be, wanted you to be able to see me here uh, in the flesh before I flip over to my uh, little PowerPoint presentation, but uh, you know, I'm really looking forward to the year. Uh, I cannot wait to get back to work and to, to start learning with you guys again. It's been a very strange and long last couple of months, so I'm, I'm really excited that we are finally back uh, and ready to get back to work. So it's awesome. Uh, I'm sure you're all feeling the exact same way. <laughs> okay, I'm going to flip over to my presentation and um, introduce myself and go through some of the expectations for chemistry this year, and we'll hopefully make it as quick as possible. Present. Okay. Um, so again, my name is Nate Garochi. Uh, my email is, is right there, ngiroche, so take off the E there, uh, at jeffgoschools.us. Uh, obviously, in particular this year with the hybrid learning model, I'm going to be on checking my email a lot, so I'm very open to communication there. And uh, please don't hesitate to contact me if you have any questions um, or concerns. I'll give you a little bit of background about me. Uh, I, I hold a degree in chemistry. I graduated in 2015 uh, from University of Colorado, Skull Buffs, and then I got my master's degree a couple years ago uh, from CU Denver in curriculum and instruction. Uh, I really love sports, in particular Colorado sports, so <laughs> it's a good time to be a Colorado sports right, fan right now uh, with the abs are rolling, Nuggets are, are doing awesome, Rockies are, are hanging in there, started really strong, and, and maybe we'll even get the Broncos coming up here soon. It's really the best time of year. Uh, I, in addition to, to the Colorado sports that I love, I really enjoy in watching and supporting high school sports and events, um, whether that's musical events or theater events. I try to do, do uh, those as much as possible. I really enjoy um, getting out there and, and seeing the students in a different context and supporting them as best as I can. And I look forward to and hope that I'll still be able to do that this year. Uh, I like going to the movies when the movies was a thing way back in 2019. I really enjoy reading books, playing video games, and watching Netflix. So I've got to do a lot of that the last couple of months. Uh, and, and the other thing I really, really enjoy to do that I haven't been able to do is travel and see the world, experience new cultures. Um, I really look forward to the time where I can get back out there and do that, uh, uh, hopefully, sometime soon. All right, enough of me. I guess um, this is my third year as a, a teacher at Golden and my sixth year as a teacher um, at, as a whole. I, I love working here. I really think that I have the best job ever. So it's great. Okay, um, the course chemistry, oh, scary. Uh, it's pretty polarizing from what I've, I've heard. People either love their chemistry class or couldn't wait for it to be over. Um, I'm gonna try to uh, get us as much in the first category as possible. Uh, chemistry is an interactive class. Um, it's fast paced, it's challenging. It's designed to prepare you for a higher level chemistry class in college or a higher level uh, college science class. Um, we do a heavy emphasis on solving problems thinking critically and trying to apply those things into a real world setting where a uh, chemist would be doing through laboratory experiments. Um, I'm not the only chemistry teacher. I also do collaborative team planning with uh, Dr. Graves. He also teaches chemistry here. He's gonna be doing so in a remote fashion uh, this, this semester, but we're gonna be um, as aligned as possible, uh, which is gonna include um, common uh, planning, uh, common assignments and common assessments. So um, it's really nice to have uh, a partner and a colleague who's doing this this chemistry thing with me. Uh, this year, we're going to be using two uh, main kind of remote learning management systems. The big one being Schoology. Um, Schoology is uh, it's our learning management system that has really good functionality that we we need for our class. Um, you'll be enrolled in my Schoology course by the time class starts, and we'll spend a decent amount of time in the first couple um, days going through how to navigate uh, Schoology, where to find things, um, how uh, the information is going to be presented and organized and structured um, on Schoology as it is going to be pretty important um, for our hybrid learning model this year. And then the other thing we'll be doing for our video conferencing, um, at this point, things are subject to change, to be honest with you, but at this point, I think I'm gonna roll with Zoom. Um, Zoom's got some really good functionality that, that we need as well. I'm a little bit more familiar with it, and so uh, we'll be using Zoom to um, broadcast our lessons, stream our lessons, um, do our Friday remote learning. Um, and so uh, hopefully, I think by the time you know we, we start here, you're, you're taking chemistry, 
uh, as, a, as a sophomore, junior, or senior. So you've got some good exposure, especially with the, the remote learning last year to both of these platforms. So they're really good. Um, and we're going to try to make them as user friendly as possible. And uh, if you have any questions about either of those platforms, please don't hesitate to reach out via email um, or phone call and ask. Uh, what we're going to study this year is uh, a lot. <laughs> uh, chemistry is really the study of matter and energy. And uh, that can break down, especially for a general chemistry course, that can break down into a lot of different topics. And we're going to kind of survey them to get a introduction into a lot of the uh, chemistry E topics. So that's going to range from the smallest things, looking at atomic theory and uh, uh, what matter is made up of to the smallest level we can possibly dissect. And then starting to think about how uh, those things interact with other things and, and we can kind of form these larger uh, uh, systems. We'll look at bonds and eventually reactions. And then we'll get into the um, kind of more practical applications of chemistry, uh, which will be our uh, uh, gases, thermodynamics, kinetics, equilibrium. <laughs> Good one. And then we'll finish here with acids and bases. So it's a lot of stuff. All of those words maybe sound foreign and could sound intimidating, but uh, uh, they're good. They're fun. They're exciting. They're interesting. They uh, hopefully will uh, allow us to push uh, the, the way at which we consider and contextualize the world around us. Uh, and that's really what chemistry is. And that's really what I love about it so much is that we, we um, further learn how to process and how to think about um, this natural world that we um, call our home. So uh, it's going to be a good year. Uh, we've got a lot to learn and, and we're certainly going to be um, capable of, of, of learning it all. <laughs> Uh, that's really all I got for you, to be honest. Um, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out. Um, know that, and you guys know this, uh, you know, things, especially this year, are going to be changing frequently. So your flexibility and uh, your uh, uh, willingness to adapt uh, is going to be uh, uh, tested this year. Certainly mine is and has already. Um, so, you know, and that's okay. And that, and that, fits perfectly in with uh, what we're going to be learning in this class, which is problem solving, thinking critically, um, use, you know, making evidence-based decisions. Um, that's what we're going to be doing uh, on, a, on a macroscopic level with our, with our courses here as well. So um, there it is. <laughs> Pretty good presentation. <laughs> All right. I look forward to uh, 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 conferencing with you guys soon and then hopefully being able to really see and meet you in person uh, in the next coming weeks. So again, don't hesitate to reach out or let me know if you have any questions. Oh, I forgot I had it in there. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> All right. Okay. How do I stop this? I'll go back over here. So uh, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll see you guys soon.